Hey guys, it's May May, and welcome to another sneak peek of our club set. Now, this is the original club. This is the one that ships on the 6th of the month. It is the first of the month set. This is not your scripture set. And if you're not a member of the club as of the time of this video, this is not the one you'll receive. You had to be a member of the club before the end of last month to be able to get this set as a club member. It is, however, available to you in what's left over, and we will restock it in our store. So this afternoon, late this evening, you'll be able to get this one in the store. If you're interested, we'll put all the extras in. Um, this one is super fun. I've been wanting to do one of these for a long time, and we needed something like this in our collection. I think we did. This one is called Banner Day. Look how cute this is. So you have all these little banners at the top, and I wanted to point out, all the letters at the bottom fit inside the banners. You have an open banner and a closed banner in every shape. And the reason for that is if you wanted to do something that had, say, a space between, maybe you wanted to do happy birthday in these flowers, you could start with a solid one and then do happy and put a solid between and then do birthday. And you have these little curved lines that kind of don't make any sense. They just hang out there. But those are so if you want to extend it or if you need to put some space between them, you can have these little lines or... If you want to put it off the edge, you can use this little bow and stamp it right down. So I also gave you some tiny sentiments. We've not done these before. These are four very well-used sentiments used in a lot of your card making, but they're tiny. They're like an, a quarter of an inch tall and around about a an inch and a quarter wide. You've got you're invited, happy birthday, let's party, and thinking of you. These I thought we could use for lots of things, especially like punching and using them maybe in the holes of punches or inside of die cuts, stuff like that. You get this cute little bow. You get a capital letter font with all the numbers all the way through zero. And you get a lowercase letter font all the way to Z. Then you're going to get hashtag, at sign, exclamation, period, question mark, plus and minus sign. And then these little brackets. I like those little brackets for different things. So I thought I'd include those and an asterisk. Lots of stuff. Let's stamp some of the banner pieces together. So I've just got some white paper here and I'm going to show you. This is probably the smaller of the banners. and I'm going to show you how the letters fit inside. So this is a uh, this is a one and a quarter inch block, but I think let me put this on a one inch so you can see that it works on that too. So here's a one inch block. Yes, it just fits there. Pull some ink over here like so. And I'm just going to stamp this on the page like so and then see I've got at this angle what you can do because I left you some kind of like rope at the end you can connect them when you can get over the top of them you can really connect them you can connect them and just keep your little banners going I'm trying not to get in your way of seeing but I may have to get up there and let you be in your way but see how you can continue your banner out as far as you want it to go then these letters fit inside. Let's use a capital letter. Let's use like a W. That's a pretty big letter. I'm going to sit that down on my work surface real quick and pick it up with a block. And then I'm going to ink it and I'll show you how it fits inside of the banner. So if you wanted to do like welcome or anything like that, it would fit. Let's zoom you in to see that really close. Check it out. So cute. You can do anything with this. You're going to be able to do Merry Christmas, Happy Birthday, You're Invited. You can do names if you have something coming up and maybe you want to put somebody's name specifically, like for maybe a grandchild, a son, or a daughter. Maybe there's a new baby and you already know their name. Um, you could announce their name this way. It'd be so cute to do this. So let's do another one. Here's this little guy. I'm going to stamp. Oh, I didn't ink him up good. I can see through there. Stamp him down. So look at that. They're so cute, aren't they? Let's put a letter in there too. Let's go with A. Sit that one down. And stamp A inside there. You can do so much. I can't wait to see what you guys do with this stamp set. Again, this one is called Banner Day. And I think it is perfect for our collection. It's such a good filler set, especially with all these fonts that you'll be able to use a hundred different ways. Hey, thanks so much for watching and being a part of our club. These are shipping out today to club members, like I said. And so if you are already a club member, if you've signed up in the past, this is the set that comes to you this month for your original club set. Thanks so much for watching today, guys. Talk to you again real soon. Bye-bye.